you, what's in a name? A lot, if the name of a road is in question, a road bearing the name of an international terrorist. What can or should the county do about it? Well, that's the debate over Sheikh Jelani Lane. It is the access road that leads to the Muslims of the Americas community in Red House. It's in a rural area of Charlotte County, about 15 miles south of Appomattox. The U.S. government considers Jelani a terrorist who's responsible in large part for the 1993 bombing of the World Trade Center. Last week, Charlotte County supervisors voted not to change the name of the road. However, a group called the Christian Action Network in Forest is stepping up its pressure on the board to do something about this road name. And they are demonstrating outside the county office building tonight in Charlotte Courthouse. That is where News 7's Steve Smallshaw joins us. Steve, the board has already voted not to change the name. What is this group hoping to accomplish? Well, Keith and Gene, they're hoping to stir up enough public discontent to get the supervisors to reconsider the issue. Again, about 20 members of the Christian Action Network will be marching from downtown Charlotte Courthouse up here to the county administration building to hold a demonstration just an hour before the board is scheduled to meet. It's one of maybe a half dozen similar enclaves across the United States, part of the Muslims of America organization founded in 1980 by Sheikh Mubarak Jelani. So naturally, when it came to naming the entrance road several years ago, neighbors here chose Sheikh Jelani Lane. The problem is the government considers Sheikh Jelani a terrorist. I just don't think that it's good for America. I don't think it's good for Virginia. And I certainly don't think it's good for Charlotte County, the home of Patrick Henry, to be honoring an international terrorist on his roadside. Martin Moyer and his group, the Christian Action Network out of Bedford County, have been pressuring Charlotte County leaders to change the road name and have it stricken from county maps. We don't think we're an outside group. This road sign is in the state of Virginia, and we are from Virginia, and we think we're here to protect the good name of Virginia that's not going to honor a road sign in this state named after an international terrorist. So we don't think we're an outside group. We are Virginia. This sign is in Virginia. So again, the supervisors are not going to take up the road name issue on their agenda tonight. There is a time for some public comment. We'll have more from that, and we'll also tell you what the Muslims up in Red House think. They're try trying to ignore this for the most part. We'll have more on that tonight at 11. Keith and Gene. All right, we look forward to hearing.